was it? Yeah, you'd stand out with this. You and Jack Tunney are going to go at it. That's exactly right, like we've done it before. Oh, here comes the earthquake right now. Oh, to Roper, down into the oh. chest. And Kevin Kruger may have had his last match after that. What a sight. Special announcement. We haven't heard it yet, but we all anticipate it. Yes, we do. Earthquake and victorious. And uh, the Earthquake uh, allegedly looking forward to doing the very same thing to Jake the Snake Roberts. I personally have my doubts. Let's take you back now to the replay. The replay. Earthquake with a real powerful power slam right there, Roddy Piper. And here's somebody that could take you to the personal oh. fitness expo. Your date, Roddy Piper, the Earthquake. Wait a minute, there's a Mean Gene Okerlund in the ring. Let's go up to Mean Gene. This is it. All right. All right. Got a haircut, didn't he? Now then, Jimmy Hart, you've got me here to witness this big announcement that you're going to make. You said it's of such magnitude that it's going to shock the world and the World Wrestling Federation. Jimmy Hart, what is that announcement? Well, first of all, Mean Gene, by now the whole world knows that the World Wrestling Federation Tag Team Champions is Jimmy Hart's Nasty Boys. All right, little applause. Let's see a people. That's no announcement. And I will right, make sure that the Nasty Boys will stay the World Wrestling Federation Tag Team Champions forever. That's not even an announcement right there. Everybody knows that, especially when they beat L.O.D. Anybody who's shot at the World Wrestling Federation Tag Team Championship belts at the Nasty Boys home. So joining forces with the Earthquake. Uh, well, wait a minute. Who, who's going to join forces with Earthquake? I'm going to tell you who's going to join forces with the Earthquake. It's going to be none other than... Are you ready, me, Gene? Oh, please. Shh. None other than Andre the Giant. What an announcement. Oh, wait a minute, Jimmy. It's Hunter. everything I thought it would you be. Have Sign a contract with Andre the Giant. As a matter of fact, I know he is in the arena this week. I am going to, to ask him to come out. I want to hear it from the man himself. Please welcome the eighth wonder of the world, Andre the Giant. I, this is going to be very, very interesting. Jimmy Hart is leaving the ring area. And here comes Andre. First of all, you took Slick, the doctor of style, and stuffed him in the trunk of his very own limousine. And that was nothing. Mr. Fuji was whining and dining you at one of the great restaurants in the world. And you took Mr. Fuji and you shoved his face in a plate of food. <laughs> That's not a good. 
And you know, sensational Queen Sherry had you at a hotel. She tried to propose. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. I beg your pardon. She tried to entice you, and she ended up getting a spanking. And Bobby Heenan, <laughs> Bobby Heenan wouldn't get within 10 miles of you, Andre. Keeping that in mind, again, I ask you, yes or no? Have you signed a contract with this man? Andre, yes, no. All right, Andre, the Giants set up Jimmy Hart. Jimmy Hart is humiliated. No, Andre set him up just like he set up all the other managers. Andre is his own man. 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 It's that good business ethics, I don't think. You should end up the Vienna Boys Choir. Jimmy Hart caught Andre the Giant a liar. He was like, wait a minute. The earthquake just clipped Andre the Giant. He took his knee right out from under him. Andre the Giant, over 500 pounds down on the canvas. The earthquake blind signing Andre the Giant. How tall is Andre the Giant now, Piper? You gotta tell, know that Quake knows his business. What do you do with a big man? What do you do with a giant? You take the wheels out from under him, you get him down, and then you do all the oh, no. damage you want to. And that's what Quake is doing. Andre, a handful of hair, he's trying to get Earthquake off his knee. Earthquake went way down low with all of his weight. He drove his shoulder along with that megaphone down into the knee, and down he goes again. You know, they say size doesn't matter, and they say it's how you use it. I think this is what they're talking about. Here on the blind side, after Andre set him up, you're talking 420 pounds he's using with momentum coming down on Andre's knee. Knee, I guess it means something. Oh! I know what that feels like. I've never seen the giant failed like this before. Out of nowhere, earthquake from the blind side, knocking Andre the Giant down. I think we're seeing an end to a great career of Andre the Giant. I have to say it was a great career. Earthquake becoming the career ender here. And again, earthquakes down again across the knee. He's not stopping. He's making sure one thing about it. You better do the job right right now, boys. Because if you don't and that big guy gets up, there's going to be trouble. T-O-R-U-D-L-E or however you spell it. I think there's another lesson to be learned here, uh, Roddy Piper. And that's uh, don't make a fool of Jimmy Hart. When you make a deal in the back, you better be ready to tell everybody. I'll drive the giant now. Wait a minute. The earthquake coming back over again. Earthquake wants to make sure Andre's not getting up any time soon. How much more damage can you do? Andre is in pain. Andre is in intense pain. I'm going to tell you something. Andre does this. Nothing. Hey, listen, Vince McMahon, you should be proud of Andre the Giant. He did a lot better than Damien did. Oh, real, real funny. Ha, ha. Real funny. I'm glad Andre. I could amuse everybody here. Uh -huh. Andre trying to get back to his feet now. With the help of the ropes, look at him. Andre, he's, he's going to stand up. Oh, seven feet, four inches of him. Ooh, he's hurt. Andre the Giant is hurt. He took out that big man's left knee is what happened. One of the problems with being a giant is you take also longer to heal. Andre on the apron. Now he's standing up. Andre will walk. No, he won't. Andre down again. Well, get some guys of some size down there. He's 520 pounds. Help him up. I think he'd be better off rolling him out. I don't think uh, Andre wants anyone to help him up. Andre, unquestionably as proud as he is large, Andre wants to make it back to the dressing room on his own power. Unfortunately, this might be last call for Andre the Giant. 
Andre hanging on to the railing, trying to make his way back. You are looking, ladies and gentlemen, at the eighth wonder of the world who just about has seen it all throughout his career in the World Wrestling Federation. But come on, Andre. Come on, Andre. People, people cheering him saying, come on, Andre. Andre. Come on, Andre. Andre with a heart as huge as his entire body. This man will not allow anyone to help him back to the dressing room. He's going to make it on his own. You're talking about intestinal fortitude. You're talking about guts, giant-sized guts. Andre the Giant with his knee. There's no telling what kind of damage was done to that knee. Andre. He can't make it. He's going to take a rest. Man. He can make it. This could be the end of the career of Andre the Giant, who unquestionably has been one of the greatest of all time, and I think we've seen him crawl back to the dressing room enough. We will not allow this indignity to continue.